welcome back to another Tennis Channel Court Report. I'm Jessica Vilches in Los Angeles. The USTA Foundation offers programs to at-risk youth across the country that combine tennis and education. This month, the foundation held their first ever fundraiser in Southern California. Sloane Stevens was among the stars at the Pro-Am, alongside Pam Shriver and her own Tracy Austin. The event was a huge success, raising more than $150,000 for the foundation's work. It's really about building character, it's about academics, it's about success, and it's about serving all. It's about not only the NJTLs, but any programs that have tennis and education. It's about wounded warriors, it's about adaptive tennis. So we want to make sure that everyone has an opportunity to excel in this sport, not just on the court, but in the classroom and in life. James Blake is the USTA Foundation's chairman. Before joining the ATP World Tour, the former world number four learned firsthand of the value of the organization. It was an experience that Blake credits with getting him interested in tennis, and one he hasn't forgotten. For me to be a part of this foundation means a lot because I was a product of an NJTL program. The Harlem Junior Tennis Program is where I first learned to play tennis. My father was a volunteer there and I love the attitude of volunteering and, and he was a great role model for me. Once I was done uh, with my learning of the tennis game at that program, I, I gave back to help out with the tennis and with the homework club. It has a lot to do with education. It's a Harlem Junior Tennis and Education Program and so many of the NJTL programs have that education factor. It's really important to me. It's why I went off to college and why I think college is so important for so many young players. Don't forget you really can take Tennis Channel everywhere on all your Amazon devices. Get all the best action on your schedule, wherever you are. Coming up, another Davis Cup Classic. Andy Murray goes head-to-head -head against Bernard Tomic from this year's semifinals. Enjoy the tennis, everyone.